oh no! <laughs> and welcome back to another episode of Planet Zoo! Planet Zoo! And yes, it's gonna tell us that we have a animal dangerous fighting. Oh, the Gorilla Gardens! <gasps> Why is Simba hurt? Simba! This is your little baby. Space. Oh, he's stuck. He's stuck, and Simba is panicking so let's see simba we can get a vet and then this little one has managed to get himself stuck on top so let's get him down and hopefully that'll make everybody better goodness me is that much better your navigatable climbing area is too small little one how and we have an animal escaped <gasps> i forgot i forgot we had to do that <laughs> is this guy gonna walk back in he is seriously just gonna walk back in <laughs> amazing okay so yes we do have the problem that they can get out right now our chimpanzees can just walk out of that exhibit ah <sighs> so we're gonna have to find a way let's see i wonder if we could just put some concrete um, concrete. Like some concrete pillars and things, which is to block off concrete wall. Can I just put a concrete wall here? And that'll block them off? Or can they just jump over that, like, in two seconds? They probably can. We could put, we're gonna have to put some rocks, I think. Some rocks and some trees and leaves to block them from, from jumping over. But we'll do this just to make it look like we've tried. <laughs> Let's see. Um, I'm pretty sure we can see here. Um, habitat. <gasps> Did we? Oh, no. Yeah. Okay. So they can jump over this. Hmm. Hmm. Um, but kind of not that easily. It doesn't look like. So let's see. Let's get some nature here and get some lovely tropical rocks and see if we can block this off. <laughs> we have jumped straight into this episode, goodness me, with um, some with uh, some chaoticness as usual and some very loud music. Let me turn that down for myself. There we go. That's better. All right, let's put some cool rocks in to try. <laughs> to try and make this better. Random rotation is on. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Okay, why is that so huge? That's better. Okay, and then maybe like one here, one here. Pretty sure they can just jump over that as well. Is that correct? <gasps> they can't! They can't just... Yay! Okay, we fixed it. We They can't jump... Wait, wait. <gasps> no, they can't jump over that. Oh, so good. Okay. But it looks like they can get out of this bit or not. I want them to be able to climb here so they can climb on that. Good. Okay. Let's just put some rocks on this one to no so it doesn't look so gross. Because. Oh. Oh. Uh oh. Sorry about that, because right now it looks very plain. Um, so let's just add a few rocks. And a few mossy rocks. Let's see, let's see. A few, like a lot, basically. Mm -hmm. There we go. And a big old one this side, and maybe add one that side. There we go! Looks good, looks really good. Okay, the social space dress. Oh boy, how are we doing? So they don't have... N much navigatable climbing area. Was this guy trying to escape? Are you trying to escape, my friend? Yeah, it looks like they can't escape, which is perfect. Um, let's give them some climbing areas then, and some. Let's see, what the species? Western chimpanzee. Oh, Otley. Dog. This dog. <laughs> Alright. 
West End Chimpanzee. Let's see. W W. Um, that the one of the last ones. A West End Chimpanzee. And let's see. Do we need some shelter for them? No, they have enough hard shelter. They just need a few good areas to do some climbing on. A food trough. Oh, that's kind of cool. Let's see. So enrichment, a climbable. Here we go. This is what they want, I'm pretty sure. Um, let's see. Yeah, we've got some climbing frames. Some basic climbing frames, which we can put around. A sun bear climbing exhibit. A small animal. Small animal. Small animal. Do we not have any, like, small animal? A lemur climbing frame. Giant ape. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Giant ape tree house. Natural climbable log. The little one there. Climbable log. Climbable log. Huh. So do we not have anything for, like, chimps? Chimp. Asian waterfall, Asian bridge, metal climbing beams. Interesting. So this doesn't look to be. Ooh, this is really cool. <gasps> oh goodness! I wonder if we can do something with this. This is so cool. Okay, I'm gonna put this down. <laughs> I'm gonna pause because otherwise. We're gonna cause panic, um, because it goes through, <laughs> goes through the poor people, their tunnel. All right, let's see. I'm gonna move this. There we go, and then we need to scooch this one in a bit. And this rock does not need to be here. There we go. This looks really cool really really cool so they can they get out <laughs> that's my question and then look at this little bridge it perfectly fits so they walk straight under <gasps> that's so well done oh my goodness i'm so happy that that fits all right let's delete this one there's like a giant stone in the middle here which we can delete don't really need these that's fine oops i deleted the bin oh no <laughs> i deleted the wall and the bin um, can I just... Oh, there we go. There. Oh my gosh, this works so perfectly. I love it. I really do. I really, really love it. Um, the only problem is possibly this bit here. But let's just cut this off and hope that they can't escape through this part. They might be able to. Um, but let's hope they can't. And hopefully we'll be able to jump onto anywhere else. This looks so good. Okay, let's let's have a little look because we can just go on this again. Can you guys escape anywhere? No, <gasps> they can't escape anywhere. This is so cool. So they can climb all along this. They can come here. They can go there. Oh my gosh, this is perfect for them. I am so so happy. This is perfect. I'm gonna put another one of these here so they can get to this shelf. Because I think this is probably for a slightly smaller animal and not the chimps. But I'm going to get rid of this straw bedding. Because I don't like straw bedding. And we can put in some, let's see. Habitat. Is there any bedding? Oh, there we go. Okay, a big old piece of green bed in there looks way better than this gross straw let's remove this and then put a bit of this in here and then one more to do up here <gasps> look at them they're like they're cleaning each other oh how cool how cool picking all the bugs out of each other's fur you guys are so cool. Razzy, how is this? Look, his navigatable climbing area is perfect. He is so happy. He's really happy with all the plants that we have in here. This is so good. I'm so happy about it. All right. Let's put down some uh, arboreal feeding platforms for them then. 
how about where are the guests again the guests are this way so we can have one here for the guests to look at and maybe one like right under here oh hell. i just realized the keeper probably cannot get over this side huh yeah that's gonna be a problem oh no wait the keeper the keeper can't get over this side mm. Okay, so we'll have to keep the food area over there. Maybe we only need one food thing, so I'm going to leave that for now. Let's pick these up out the ground. Just duplicate them a bit. Because they're so cool! There we go. Alright, and then let's add some more. Wow, it's getting so busy! Everybody loves the uh, chimpanzees, apparently. Oh no, we have animals dying. That's not good. Oh, um, um my aardvark died! Oh no! Oh, how sadness. Oh, goodness. We need to sort those those aardvarks out. They've never had a really good proper exhibit, realistically. All right. Let's see. So we have African walkway. <gasps> oh, this is so cool. I mean, they're not exactly African. <laughs> but how cool does that look? It looks so, so cool. And a hard shelter. African walkway. Look how cool that is. It looks so cool and it goes pretty well. <laughs> oh, I want to put this in. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. I kind of want to put it in. But they are tropical animals and it wouldn't really go. Wouldn't really go. Let's see. Put some rocks in here. Just for decoration purposes. Some nice little rocks around. Oh, I love how they naturally turn. Oh, it makes my day. Every time. Makes my day. There we go. And then let's put some cool things this side. Who's that? Blossom. The pink flamingo is about to die of old age. And then a tropical... Whoops. A tropical rock. Or two... Look at them climbing! Look at them! Look, 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 look! It's literally climbing. <laughs> the glass! Oh my goodness, you're so cool! And I think they're actually like licking through the glass. <gasps> Is that what you're doing, sir? Oh, you're so cool. Oh, he's so cool. <laughs> look at them both! Oh, I love it. I love it. And one of our Bengal tigers is about to mature. <gasps> oh, one of our baby Bengal tigers. Oh, that's going to be interesting. That's going to cause some trouble, I think. Oh, look. Look, 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 look. Oh, goodness. Look how cool this is. She's climbing up. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> it's so cool. Everybody's coming to see. Everybody is so excited. I've never seen this place more crowded in my entire life. <gasps> Oh, okay. Let's just really quickly pause. And then we need to run over because there's definitely a few things happening here. Like the Garials maturing. Greater flamingos maturing. I mean, the flamingos are just so difficult. Alright. Greater flamingo. Glorial. Glorial again. Off you go. Oh boy, we missed a lot. Hang on now. Diego has matured, and he is one of the giant anteaters, and I think that's probably what's causing some trouble. I'm a lay in a tapir, who I will remove. Um, this male flamingo can go to the wild. And this female flamingo, off you go. Giant otter! Oh, the baby otter's matured! Yes! Okay, let's remove these before it causes more trouble. The okapi are fighting. Because this female has matured. There we go. She's gone off. Flamingos. Flamingos. More flamingos. Galarials. Off you go, my friend. Alright. I think that might be everyone. Oh, no. There's another Galarial. There we go. A Galarial. Another one there. Oh boy, they're all growing up. Goodness. Vanya. 
of you guys and that's everyone good okay <laughs> oh and we have manya who's about to mature she's a little baby a little baby tiger cub and she's napping and she's so cute we have two baby tiger cubs i think yes meha and manya and they are about to grow up and these are the parents <gasps> wait are they just did they just mate <gasps> snail wait snail ah oh, she's not pregnant okay that's fine but they did just try i'm pretty sure i'm definitely sure that was a try or maybe just an interaction. Wow, they have really good genes. They are getting bored of some of their enrichment, though. Are you guys going to mature anytime soon? We have a pangolin expecting offspring. Hmm, I guess we'll leave these dudes to do their thing. And we have Salmon Pink, who's causing trouble. <laughs> okay, let's head over. Woo, a dark for two seconds there. I could, actually. We could put a little uh, dome over these guys to give them some protection goodness that's quite hard though oh there we go <laughs> okay let's put her in the trade center because she's matured and so has this m m female we're gonna actually release her to the wild there we go and should i release the other female tiger i'm pretty sure we have a lot of tigers um animal storage Let's see, tiger. Oh, and this this male tiger. I've just seen him. Got distracted. Okay. Um, animal trading. Tiger, Bengal tiger. Here we go. Okay, yes, yeah, so she can go. We have so many females who are really, really golden that they those two can just go. That's fine. Be released into the wild. Whoops, wrong button. We definitely have to add some extra plants in here next episode what is this guy doing is he just gonna dump this no he's not gonna dump. <gasps> you literally have a place to put it sir you have a place and it's literally here and uh, maybe this maybe this rock is blocking him but he literally has an arboreal feeding platform which is accessible to put the food on and he dumps it in a pile here what is this pile goodness me yes exactly exactly my point goodness how how annoying well that is gonna be the end of this episode <laughs> and i'll see you guys next time and hopefully we can get some chimpanzees breeding to complete this challenge that we have i'm so glad this fit in here i really really love this really cool climbing frame i think it looks so cool and the little bridges and how it fits perfectly over our roof oh i can't wait for the guests to start going through thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys next episode goodbye for now